Hi guys and welcome once again to another episode of Tech the Things. Now today in the program I'll be heading to the various marine stores in Grand Cayman. Now the first store I'll be heading to is Kirk Marines and this is located on Eastern Avenue. Now if you're new to the channel just remember to subscribe and if you want the latest video when it's posted then you can click the notification bell. So let me kick things off. Now Kirk Marine are the marine stores in general. They sell uh, marine stuffs, which is fishing equipment, <coughs> engines, boats, wave runners, surfing stuffs. So I must let you know guys, I'm not that familiar with most of the marine stuffs. So you can just look around as I go along. Now, as I enter the store, the famous scent of fiberglass paraphernalia hit me. When you know the resin, the fiberglass itself, and all of those stuffs, <coughs> I, I could spell, get this strong scent of it hustling through my nose. So, this fridge, it contains bait, and as you see, the signs there of what type of baits are in the fridge so i'm just taking a little nosiness and go inside to just see the so i move around there's a surf there small stuffs the wave runners to the to the left You have paddles, life jackets. So if in case you, you can't really swim or just for safety purpose, it's good to have one of these. And so when you're entering the water, especially if you're going to where you cannot stand, it's good to have to, to have one on you. Keep you afloat. It's a large wave runner here. All the floating stuffs you have the clothing for the for the sea various footwears it's soft to the touch <coughs> and there are some some uh, sunglasses and they are quite pricey, I can tell you that. Ranging from 100 to 300 Cayman Islands dollars. And if you want to know the equivalence, <coughs> it's 80 cents Cayman Islands dollars to one US dollar. Or sometimes it's, it's um, 84 cents. So here you have the, the various artificial baits. <coughs> various sizes, various colors. And the, the neon ones are really to, especially if you're going to fishing in the night, you want the fishes to see them. These are some other types of bait. These, these are like fishes. <coughs> the one before I like squids, but these are like fishes and shrimp. And some large hooks. One, uh, one has to wonder what, <laughs> what size fish uh, this thing are for. And these are the, the rods. Rod and wheel. 
for persons who do line fishing. They don't do net fishing here. I, I, I can say I haven't seen any and I've been here for a while. Just line. And if you have, if you're doing spear fishing, you, you will have to get a license from the Department of Environmental Health. Sorry, Department of Environment. These are the lines, various sizes, various thickness as well. Those are the line older. So this wraps up my tour of the Kirk Marines. My next location will be Scott's Marine in North Sound Road. Now here I am at Scott's Marine very large place as well so I'm just making my look around this is a little in my opinion this is a little bit larger than Kirk Marines you have a huge boat in here and all the various things that can be used to clean the boat There's no price attached to it. If you want it, you might have to go to the, the purse over the counter. There's the, there are the clothing for the boats. Small boats, small engines. And these engines, rear, it starts from about 1300 to when you go around further where they are the huge engines you'll find them so about twenty thousand dollars but the huge the huge boats the huge engines they don't put any price on them i am not sure but why but it's there it's mercury brand engine there's no price attached to it So I'm going over to the other side. You'll see the rod and wheel here as well. These are the kayaks. sunglass speakers and the batteries and these batteries are not for cars or trucks is for boats and here you have the customer service reps but I'm not stopping there I'm going over to the other side you have a next boat and all the boating stops the oil there's a small boat here the 
engine again. No, I am not so sure of this. I can only guess that it's a floating purpose and people would take it to the water and even the, the middle part, will use it like a trampoline. So I'm just going outside to let you see the backyard area. So I'm assuming these boats are for sale and the one that inside of the yard I'm just gonna go down there to let you see it for yourselves. Put on my sunglasses because the sun is really hot. So the vehicle here is belongs to Scott's so as you see the logo on it. It's a big yard for the boats and these are the boats in the yard I'm not going down there but those boats I'm assuming are for sale or for repairs and this is the yard so I'm entering it re-entering this store and I'm gonna leave and head to the next location take off but my sunglasses and just let you see inside the store so if you're interested in purchasing any things for the sea such as line hooks sinkers baits these are the places that you can go there are other places that sell them it's just that these are the major stores So this wraps up my, the end of my tour of Scots Marines and I'll be heading to next location, Harbour House Marine and it would be, it's on Marina Drive in the Prospect area. So this is Harbour House Marine. As you see this yard is very big and I would assume this one is the largest of the three marine stores as you see the sign there I'm passing the gentleman having a chat on his phone And the thing that caught my eye is that helicopter there, small one. But the store is very huge. As you see those kayaks at the top of the building. I'm just going to walk around and let you see for yourselves. Those are some small engines. And there's a Honda, it's Honda model. I'm assuming that Harbour House Marina is the dealer of the, uh, the Honda brand Marine Stuffs and Scots would be for the Mercury brand. And those are some buoy, which is a floating apparatus in the sea can use them to float you can put them to the side of the boat so that they don't damage when they reaches the shore so many things to look at here from cleaning equipment fragrance equipment or fragrance stops
And also you can smell the scent of the the resin for the fiberglass stuffs. There's a wax which is are the wax with shampoo used to wash the the boat. I normally use them to wash my car as well. It give it a a shiny outlook. These are things that are used on the side of the boat for docking where you can tie the rope around. And these are ropes as well, so it's on the same aisle. This is mainly the rope section as well. These are batteries for the boat. And ropes are here in different sizes. Some huge, huge ropes. and some of the pulley apparatus. So I'm gonna go upstairs because this one is the one it says upstairs. So I can see what's up there as well. These are speakers, different types of speakers. It looks very attractive. Because the gentleman is asking me if he can assist me, which is not what I really want. I want to have a free look around and so that you guys can have a look around as well. clothing wear now I'm wondering if this is a waterproof shoe so I'm gonna just check the gentleman and ask him if that is so so that's a negative on his side not waterproof shoe so let me just carry on so here is me mainly for the the, the, the outfits, shoes, clothing. So I'm gonna leave the store now, but I'm gonna take a walk around the the rear of the building to have a to see around. So I was just looking at the the helicopter. Price is uh, in the thousands. 
I think it's 1200 and stuff it's posted there I was wondering if it has, it has camera, but put on my sunglass again. So I'm just going to have a walk around the back. So this is what it looks like from the canal. There's a huge object right there. I'm not sure if it's a wrecked ship, but boats go that side and head out in the ocean or the Caribbean Sea. So this is where I leave you guys and I hope you enjoy this tour of the marine stores in, in Grand Cayman. If you do, you can leave a comment and if you don't, you can also leave a comment. I also implore you guys to share the video. So, on behalf of the Tech of Things team, I would like to say peace out.